Rolf Road here. Today we're going to be talking about the Rome Vagabond Light. Let's just get started. First thing, these buckles, I'm pretty sure the only ones that are different than all the other soft shell tents with the, uh, the uh, four foot straps right over there. So you're going to hit these buckles. I like to do them as I zip. Oh, zipper goes this way. Let me get that half zipped. You're gonna hop down. I guess you might as well just get these. Forget the zipper idea while you do it. You're gonna come in here. Hop that. Flip your corner up. Flip your corner up. Alright, that's all pretty standard. Then you flip the bag over. You have four of these, two here. I just did the two on the other side. Now, pulled this ladder all the way out. Obviously this isn't gonna work. Where a lot of people get this wrong is they start going from the bottom. No. These locks push the locks of the next stair. You need to come from the top. There you go. Definitely locked. Totally solid. Start flipping these down. All right. And then if you were in a pinch, I mean, you could freaking button these down, button that down or roll it up and be done. But doing the full setup today, guys. Full kit. All right, so if you look at the uh, 23-0 walkabout or the Rome Vagabond or the CVT Pioneer Extended, they come out and cover the ladder, the fabric. This is all boxed out. And then they have these awnings over the windows. And if you look at the 23-0 Breezeway, it has this style over the ladder and then flat windows. So this is kind of a combo of both, like how the CVT non-extended is. The cool thing about Rome is they have these that you can just keep this button down. Everyone has that, but they also have these loops up there, which make it so you can just roll that whole bad boy up. Look at that. A couple things that Rome includes in all their tents are a black ladder, diamond plate floor, two boot bags, um, this gear loft just freaking goes in like this. That's kind of neat. Nice, nice. They also include loops for this. So that you can tuck it out of the way. Alright, there's toggles in there that it goes to, but my rack is blocking them, so it's not gonna work. <laughs> you get the idea. Coming up here, you have a nice mattress. You have a nice anti-condensation pad that's also Velcroed in. Pretty nice. Now, this is the light. It is the smallest. It is 48 by 85. Um, so keep that in mind, but that's kind of what I like about it. It's cozy, it's cool. Up here. One thing they do is they have clear plastic in their rain fly. Some of the other tents, you open this up and you're just looking at the bottom of the rain fly. This also has its own mesh, full open. You get two of those. This window, despite what you do with the awning flap outside, has its own waterproof and mesh. Same with that, same with this. You get two vents. What do we got? Four pockets, that's it. It's the Rome Vagabond Light in uh, slate and navy. Also available in forest and orange and uh, all black. Let's just do a light test while we're in here. I mean, you might as well. I know the black is very dark. It's 
not pitch black like the 23-0, but it's really dark. Shoes off. All right, not very dark, but I also don't sleep in my tent at high noon, so it is what it is. Then you gotta go get the shoes. You gotta get the shoes, John. Should've used the boob bag, huh? There you have it. That's the Rome Vagabond light. Honestly, if I was getting any tent, this is what I would get. Cause I'm alone 90% of the time. I don't have a dog, I don't have a kid. Um, it's tiny, it's light, it's small. It's the skinniest on the rack. Still have crazy space up here. So it's, uh, this is what I would do. Maybe even in this color. I like all their colors. I, uh, I don't know. This is what I would do. It's nice. It's just really nice. All right, now we're gonna close this thing. It's not gonna take long, but I promise you, it's gonna be the opposite of opening it. Oh boy. <laughs> She's slippery, boys. They're slippery. There you have it, the Rome Vagabond light. I like it a lot. I like these straps better than the things. Also just looks kind of cool. Looks like if you were in an action movie and they made like an airdrop of some package, this is like what it would look like. So that's fine. It took six minutes, like four seconds. Um, do have a little bit of complications because that awning is blocking me on the other side. And also, I should have this a couple inches more forward. This is kind of a pain, right? It's sitting like halfway on this bar, um, but whatever. Michael probably put a different tent on here in a week, so who cares? Doesn't even matter. So that's it. I don't know. Go buy one. Buy one from us. about planes. Looks old.